Hi guys, I'm Nicole Fig. Welcome back to my channel. We are going to do reels today, okay? So hold up your drum, okay? Don't worry about the left hand or the tonal hand. For now, okay? So what we're gonna do, I just wanna uh, warm up a little bit. So let's just do down, up, down, up, okay? Just very simple, ready? And down, up. Okay, now let's try it a little bit faster. Ready? And... Good. Okay, now let's talk about reels. So reels are gonna count to four. So one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. But you're gonna put the emphasis on the one. Just for now, just on the one for now, okay? So it's gonna be one, two, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, and the one is just gonna be a, a downbeat. Ready? And. Good. Okay, now let's try it a little bit faster, yeah? And. People also learned it by saying Coca-Cola, 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 Coke. So they're putting like a little bit tiny extra at the end. So it's gonna be Coca-Cola, 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 Coke. Yeah, so let's try it like saying that, okay? Ready? And Coca-Cola, 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 Coke. Coca-Cola, Coca-Cola, Coca-Cola. Let's try a little bit faster saying the Coca Cola one, okay? Ready? And Coca Cola, 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 Coca. Good. Now I'm gonna do the same in numbers, okay? Just so you can see how how it sounds with numbers, okay? Ready? And one, two, three, four, one, two. Let's do it a tiny bit faster, yeah? Ready? Go! Tiny bit faster, ready? And... Good. Faster? And. Good. Okay, now I'm putting the stop, the one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one. Pause. You don't have to put the pause. I just, I just like it for uh, when you're starting and also because you can put a triplet there as well. So if you don't want to put it, it will sound something like Sounds like a train Good job! 
job guys so um you can play um, up to here as many times as you need just to get comfortable okay and the next part of the video I'm gonna put um, the left hand or the tonal hand and after that then I'm gonna show you a variation of this same um, of this same group okay so practice a lot okay be patient with yourself and I'll see you in the next video bye Hi guys, I hope you had a good rest. Now we're gonna put the tonal hand to our groove, okay? Now this is the way I do it. Um, I know that there's different ways of doing it, but I'm just gonna show you the way I do it, okay? So for this particular groove, I want it to be really bassy. You know, I, I, at the emphasis, I really want it to be one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, like really bassy and, and grounding, okay? So the way I do it is that I'm gonna put my hand down here for the one. So the one is always gonna be your base, okay? So I do that, but then when I go to the two, three, four, I don't want it too high. I don't want it to be too high pitched. So what I do is I literally just put this down. So I'm not putting my hand flat though, remember, never put your hand flat. But it's kinda of like I'm just barely touching the skin, just to just to really emphasize the difference between my bass and my two three and four okay so my one and my two three four but it's it's a very slight move okay so let me play it first and then i'll show you how to do it okay so you see it's very it's very it's it's almost it's, it's almost the same, you know, it's very delicate, it's a very delicate change. So, the way it looks when I play it kind of fast, it's... It's kind of the same as the jig, you have to uh, think about, like you have to move your hand before you actually get to the two. So it's one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. So it's barely like this. Okay, you can do it like that, if that makes it better, just don't press too hard, otherwise it'll be like... And we're not getting there yet, <laughs> we'll get there, we'll get there right now. So my hand is kind of at the same position. The only thing that I'm doing is I am moving my index finger up. Okay, I don't know if you can see that. Yeah, it's just very slight, basic. Ground yourself, yeah? So there I was just playing a little bit, if you could uh, if you could hear, with the basses and with the stops. So um, now just explore a little bit with it, um, just trying to find where you can put the pauses or where you can put more of the bass or if you leave it open for certain parts or, you know, just experiment with it yourself and try to see what you like, okay? Um, so now I uh, want to show you a different variation to that same group. What you're going to do is is the same thing, pretty much. So it's it's still one two three four one two three four one two three four one two three four. But now I want you to put the emphasis on the one and the three. Okay, so it's going to be. Um, so I'm going to put my hand here for for a second. Yes, yeah? so it's a one two three four one two three four one two. my hand 
it's not here anymore. Because I, I want to reach the pop, so it's actually... The other one was bass, 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 bass. This is bass, pop, bass, pop, bass, pop, bass, pop. One, two, three, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Yeah, okay, let's do it a little bit faster, okay? Don't worry about this hand yet. So, ready? And. Okay, a little bit faster, ready? And And now that that sounds almost like it's just one, three, 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 one, three. Okay, now let's put the tone on hand, okay? So now, remember how I said in the, for the previous group that everything was here and everything was very delicate? Well, this one's kind of a bit more punchy, it's a bit, it's the opposite really. So you're gonna do bass, pop, and the way I do the pop, yeah, is from here, I turn my hand towards the skin, but I don't, I never put my hand flat, right? And then you can, you're kind of pinching with these two fingers, the index and the thumb, you're kind of pinching and you're hitting your hand above it. So not, not under, but above it. You see the difference? Okay, and you press and you hit. Okay, so I'm doing bass, up, bass, Okay, so try to practice that. Bass, pop, and bass, and pop, and bass, pop, bass, pop. And now you can do the pop, but it doesn't have to be so poppy, or it can be more poppy than what I'm doing. But that's kind of more like a stylistic choice, or maybe it fits the tune better than it's not completely poppy, you know? So what you can do is the same. Instead of bass, bass, you're doing it a little bit not as um, high toned. Ready? One, two, three, four, 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 or Let's do it faster, ready? And higher. higher. So when it's getting faster, you've noticed that like if I let me do it fast. You see, I'm I'm opening the drum, but I'm not going all the way down here anymore because I don't have I don't really have time to do this if I got really fast. So I'm kind of letting, letting, letting um, my hand off the drum. Okay, you can do, if, you, if you need 
something to kind of, uh, you feel that the drum is going to go, you can kind of put your uh, middle finger down here. Or what you can do as well is make this your bass. Okay, so instead of being bass and snare, how I call it, or bass and pop, make it like your bass and your pop. So, see, that's easier, I think. That's the way I, I do it most of the time. Or, see, bass, bass, middle, bass, middle. Okay, so let's slow it down a little bit more. And then now just concentrate on getting the bass here and from the snare. So bass, snare, bass, snare, bass, snare, just that much. Ready? Okay, now let's work on from here to the higher bit. Ready? And Now let's try to do it really bassy to the pop. So that way you can, like I said, you can put your hand here. You can just not not touch the skin at all. Or if you if you need to, maybe go up here or try to figure out the best way for you to get like really bassy to the pop. helps if you have any more questions um, comment down below let me know if there's anything else you want to know or if you have uh, um, any other ways that you play it and maybe you can send me um, like a link or something like that just let me know how you play it as well yeah I would love to uh, figure out like different approaches and the way people listen to the grooves and the tunes differently I love I love that yeah so thank you so much for watching guys and um, I'll see you in the next video Bye!